WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we've got a sea of green out here. We've got all the U.S. indices that we track trading to the upside, as well as all the sectors with inside the S&P 500. Let's take a quick rundown. You've got uh, the Dow. Uh, the Dow. You've got the. Uh, the Dow up 112 points, three tenths of a percent, six tenths for the S&P or 31 points, seven tenths, eight tenths for the NASDAQ 100, 125 points there, half percent for the Russell, that's about 10, one and three tenths for the semis, that's a 52 point move there. We're going to spend some time, take a look at those semis. Gold's up about 12 bucks, silver's up 30 cents. You've got light speed crude trading out at 73.55, up a buck 37. Natural gas is off six cents. 30 treasuries basically flat, printed out 122.25. Let's go figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We begin by looking at the ES mini. What do we have here? Well, we do have price trading below its profiles. Um, and the profile level there is 47.8255. That's a level of resistance. The price to watch today at today's close is going to be 47.6650. Where'd that come from, Steve? -O? Well, that's actually yesterday's high. If we get a close above that, we very likely are going to go ahead and get a two day rally. Now, that would also be the signal for the spot volatilities, which right now is trading below its 50 day expense moving average. However, if it makes it all the way down to that rising trend line, that is a likely spot where the spot fix is headed to. And that's where we would likely see as price gets down there to spot fix, that's likely where we'd see that top inside of the ES mini. So ideally we get a two day rally and those would be the signals that we'd be looking for. The same is true with regard to the NQ, the number it needs to close above today to really add to the idea of a two day rally, at least a two day rally is 16,587.25. So watch that. The US dollar index, well, we can see that's got all kinds of resistance. First, it's the top of its daily profile, 102.25. 26 and second it's that descending trend line so those are the areas that the dollar has to clear in order to suggest that there is a further rally going on in the case of gold nice rally out there it has support at both the rising trend line the bottom of its profile it's trading right up into resistance and that's at the 2072.80 to 2085 level that's its bearish structured daily profile silver has held its rising trend line so it has been trading below profile there is a new profile it's trying to form that's above price right now. That's where price ran in resistance. That, by the way, is up at the uh, 2362 level. You can see lights we crude also trading into trend line resistance out there. Likely we'll see natural gas pull back to about $2.44 and a 30 year treasury still holding profile support. Steve Rhodes with TFNN, folks. Stay tuned for the Trader Set Show. But if you have to start your Friday, have a fabulous one. Thanks so much for joining us. We look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now. Thank you.